Apple finally lets iPhone and iPad users customize their home screen. With the release of the iOS 14 and iPad OS 14 software updates, which introduced the ability to add personalized widgets and even change the look of app icons, you can see examples of users' home screens all over Twitter, TikTok, YouTube, and other social platforms. For instance, the process of customizing your home screen as anything but quick and seamless. Apple could have rolled out settings option or dedicated app designed to help you get the home screen aesthetic of your dreams, but nope, you have to rely on third party apps and even implement hacky workaround using Siri shortcuts. Confused? No worries. We guide you step by step below. Step 1. Update your iPhone to iOS 14. Make sure your iPhone is up to date. Update your iPhone to the latest version of iOS, which, at the time of initial publishing, is iOS 14. Here is Apple's support page on how to do that. Step 2. Choose color palette or theme. Find wallpaper and save it to your camera roll. Find coordinating icon pack and save it to your camera roll. Figure out your desired home screen aesthetic. Do you like nude colors? Do you want something more retro? Check out some examples below for inspiration. As part of this process, you'll want to pick color palette or theme, find wallpaper, and download an icon pack or graphics to replace your app's existing icon art. We recommend combing through Pinterest, Google Images, Etsy, and other resources. You can go quite simple with this, with minimalist, yet, Lux background image and glittery app icons to pair with it, or you can get complicated and try to do something time intensive like replicate the PlayStation 2's memory card screen. Step 3. Download Widgetsmith and Shortcuts Download Widget Customizer app like Widgetsmith Download Shortcuts app You need two apps to help you actually customize your home screen's widgets and apps. Widgetsmith and Shortcuts. Widgets add quick access functionality to your home screen, like weather or the calendar at glance. You'll need Widgetsmith to create widget with whatever background color, photo, and font you want. There are alternatives in the App Store, such as Color Widget, but we've used Widgetsmith and can verify it works. As for shortcuts, it lets you get automate tasks via apps or by asking Siri. You can also use shortcuts to create custom app icons. It's been around for a long time, but with the release of iOS 14 and the ability to add widgets to the home screen, many people are now pairing the two functionalities to create unique home screen. Step 4. Clean your home screen. Remove all your old apps from the home screen. Once you've got all your materials handy, start cleaning your home screen. Hold down on each app to access pop-up menu that will let you remove it from your home screen. Select remove app. Move to app library or delete app. Do this until your screen is clear. Apple's support page offers more help if you need it. Step 5. Set your new wallpaper. Go to settings wallpaper. Choose new wallpaper. Now we can begin the process of actually creating your new home screen. Let's start by setting that new wallpaper you picked out in step 2. Go to settings. Tap wallpaper. Then tap choose new wallpaper. Apple also has support. Page here with more details if you need it. Step 6. Change your app icons. Open the Shortcuts app and follow these steps for every app you want to add to your home screen with custom icon. In the Shortcuts app, hit the button to create new shortcut. Select Add Action on the next page. Search for the Open App option and then select it. Tap the and then favorite this action for quick access later. On the new shortcut page, tap Choose next to Open. Search and select an app. Example. Messenger. Tap the three dot menu in the corner. On the details page, give your shortcut name or wait phrase for Siri to recognize. Tap add to home screen. Name your shortcut and then tap the icon thumbnail next to the name you entered. You can then take or choose photo to replace the app's existing icon. Select choose photo from your camera roll. Select the app icons or graphics you saved earlier. You will be asked to frame the shot. Preview your changes and tap add to add the app to your home screen. It will be added to your home screen as bookmark, but it works like an app. 